hot or not? Hot or not, and another MRE to check for me. Meal ready to eat. It's a shawarma. It says it's Ostra, that means hot. Well, we will see. It's from a brand called uh, Sphinx Restaurants. Original dishes from uh, restaurants in your home. Shawarma is a dish from uh, Middle East. It's something like a kebab or gyros. This is a version with rice, vegetables from a pan and the red beans and of course the chicken meat. We can see a picture of how it looks like. 2-3 minutes in the microwave and uh, I gotta say it looks good. Let's check out the back. The back at the top uh, is the same as in the front. And it says uh, Sharma is an iconic dish from the Sphinx restaurant, which we serve to our guests for more than 20 years. Premises all over Poland. Its unique taste owes its recipe, based on an original composition of 16 herbs and spices. Now you can enjoy its taste in your home. Taste them all and choose your favorite. There are other uh, versions of this shawarma. We have cheddar, we have a version with champignons, tandoori and curry. Bon appetit from uh, Claudius Wachowiak. Hot or not? We have cooking instructions, how to prepare it uh, in microwave or oven. I will use the micro. Now for uh, the ingredients. Boiled rice, 43%. That's water, rice, salt, baked chicken, shawarma 28% from a chicken leg, uh, 132 grams of meat used to make 100 grams, fuck logic, uh, spice mix for chicken, that's salt, maltodextrin, mustard, yeast extract, uh, garlic, sugar, sunflower oil, acidity regulator E330, spice mix for shawarma, herbs, mustard, more, Salt, aroma, contains soy, dried vegetables, rapeseed oil, vegetables from pan, 11%, that's red pepper, yellow pepper, green pepper in variable proportions, red onion, white onion, champignons, rapeseed oil, taco seasoning, that's interesting, grill seasonings, uh, contains gluten, aroma, preparation, paprika, tomato, relish, 11%, that's paprika, relish, 50%, that's water, paprika, 20%, sugar, spirit vinegar, onion, carrot, cucumbers, corn, modified corn starch, lime, juice, salt, seasonings, chili extract, uh, seasoning extract, thickener, xanthian gum, hibiscus concentrate, that's interesting, tomato ketchup, 50%, 160 gram, tomatoes used to prepare 100 grams of the product, sugar, modified corn starch, again, salt, again, acidity regulators, acidic acid, citric acid, natural aromas, seasonings, grinded chili pepper, chili extract, aroma, preparation again, red beans, 6%, that's red beans, water, salt, antioxidant, ascorbic acid, aroma, preparation again, stewed leek, 0.6%, that's leek, rapeseed oil, and again with aroma preparations, product may contain shellfish, eggs, milk, fish, nuts, celery, sesame, the nutrition information, let's check how it looks before we boil it. It doesn't look very tasty. Rice and this shawarma. And it's done. It looks kind of like a mess, but at least it has its colors. So, there's nothing else to do for me than to taste it. So, bon appetit, hot or not. Not bad, but the rice, of course, have no taste, tasteless, needs some salt. It's not bad, but unfortunately, it's not hot at all. Maybe a little spicy, but tasty. There is a nice little spice in it. Yeah, like I said, this is nice. The rice is not nice. Not nice rice. But this shawarma, chicken, 
really 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 good so many chili in it and it's not hot just a little spicy but at least it's tasty sorry i'm speaking with my mouth full but i just want to share with you with my opinion and i gotta say i wish that the portion would be bigger because there is way too much rice and this shawarma is just a small portion i think it should be bigger but it's really really nice really tasty mm, really nice with some little spice that's all not hot but very good so if you find it anywhere near you buy it i recommend it because it's really tasty and it's uh, kind of cheap because i gave it four dollars something like that but i gotta say the portion of the shawarma is too small it should be bigger that was hot or not?